Hey guys, it's Jennifer. I am back with um, my Dollar Tree haul number two. So this was the first Dollar Tree that I stopped at today. Um, this is one that I don't frequent very often just because it's kind of out of my way. And um, today I decided to go ahead and take the time to stop by there. It's actually, um, I went to Columbus, which is where my husband works. And... Um, we drive through this town and that's where this Dollar Tree is and so but normally like when I'm going there I don't have time to stop it's kinda off the road and you know um, so today I knew I had a little bit of time so I went ahead and uh, made an effort to stop just to see what they had I was hoping to pick up a few more things for my daughter's birthday and I did find some stuff and I found some other things that I wanted so I'll go ahead and share them with you so first off you can see that I found these bins these are the very large ones um, I grabbed the last four that I found there. I was really excited to find these to use um, in my um, craft room, or yeah, my craft um, organization. So, and I believe these stack. I don't know. I haven't tried, but I'm pretty sure that they do. So I was really excited to find those. I was hoping to find more of the collapsible bins, but they did not have any. So, anyways, I'm gonna share with you real quick what is in here, and then I have a couple other bags. So I grabbed up a, another food tent. This one is in the mint green to go with my daughter's stuff for her birthday. I found these really cute loot bags. These are the large ones. A while back I had handle, uh, handled, hauled ones that had candles on them. And um, so I found this design that I thought was really cute too. I don't know necessarily that we'll use them but if not I thought too they were also cute just to have if you want to give someone a birthday gift and it's a small gift you can you know stuff a little bit of tissue paper in there maybe like a candle or something because they are quite large they are 13 and a half by 8 and 3 quarters inches so grab those I did grab some thank you cards these match the invitations that we got and I just thought they were really cute and would be good for writing thank yous afterwards. I grabbed a, another dish mat because um, I don't know why I didn't grab two the first time. You know they are pretty small and sometimes when I have larger items that I hand wash you know it's nice to have two of them. And I went ahead and grabbed another dish towel to match just because it is so cute. Alright um we've got this little um emoji like plush really really cute it's for my daughter's friend she had broke her nose and had surgery and now she's recovering and so she loves anything emoji themed and I had actually found this cute little bracelet at Walmart normally $15 um, it is stainless steel fine jewelry um, from Hallmark and it was marked down to $3 so I snatched that up for her and when I saw they had these little plushies, and these are really nicely made. And they are green bar, but they are really nicely made. Like, the material is nice quality, and the stitching is very, very well done in them. So, I thought that was just too cute and too perfect, and had to get that. Alright. I snagged a set of paper plate holders, because sometimes we use paper plates. And I feel like they're real flimsy. And, you know, we're eating something heavier, then I got to double up on them. So then this way we can just use these with the paper plates. And, um, yeah, I'll be a little bit sturdier. Alright, so if you watched my previous haul, I hauled a toolbox. And I wanted some screwdrivers, but they didn't have any, or at least the ones that I wanted at that Dollar Tree. But they did at this one, so I grabbed this pack of screwdrivers. And I have another pack. And then I wanted the little teeny tiny ones because last week I was trying to open something so my granddaughter put the batteries on and it was a little teeny tiny one and it took me about forever to do it. Alright, I grabbed two bags, two packs of these little clear mini loot bags. These are actually for the kids at work for the fifth grade. Um, every year for the fifth grade we do like just like a little treat for them. So this year, last year they got ice cream sundaes and little goodie bags. This year they can get brownies and little goodie bags. So I grabbed the I found this really cool magnetic clip, heavy duty, and it is, it is heavy, and it's like solid. 
So um, this is by the Jot brand. I haven't seen this before, but I went ahead and grabbed one because I thought it'd be nice to have on the fridge because sometimes, you know, you have heavier stuff, thicker stuff that you might want to put up there. All right. I have hauled this before and I lost the last one that I hauled, so I grabbed another one. This is the Age Defy Dark Circle and Puffiness Serum. Um, I have used it before and it seemed to work, so I went ahead and grabbed another one. Alright, so I was really excited to find some more of the Revlon Parfumery nail polishes. I think I found five. Yeah, five. So, really, really happy for that. Um, this is China Flower, African Tea Rose, Sponge Sugar, Bordeaux, and apricot nectar so I really liked all these colors so the only one really left that I want to find and I have not is the pink pineapple I would love the pink pineapple first of all I think the color is gorgeous and second of all I love pineapple so but unfortunately haven't found that one don't know that I will but all right so they had a bunch of magnets hanging out by the register and this is the one that I picked out it says when I say I won't tell anybody my best friend obviously doesn't count so really cute, and obviously, I'm going to be sending this to my best friend in California. Alright, so that's what was in that basket. Alright, another item I was really excited to find was these super cute bottles. They are plastic. They do not say if they're BPA free or not. I didn't even think to check that, but they're really cute. I actually grabbed three for myself. So I grabbed the pink one, the purple one, and then this green one, and they all have a different design. And there was a fourth one. Well, I ended up going back and grabbing four more because I thought those would be adorable for the girls at work for the end of the year, and I'm probably going to fill them with like candy or some sort of something. So when I grabbed them, grabbed four more, I went ahead and grabbed the blue one so that I would have four different ones to give them. And I really like the blue one, too. Um, the only reason I didn't grab it for myself is, I don't know, it just threw me off being the, the fact that the bottle was blue. Sometimes Dollar Tree's a little weird about how they design things. It's like they have three clear designs and then one blue one. I just didn't get it. So, anyways, so I got, these are the repeats and then a blue one. So, those are for the girls at work. They're really cute. I decided to find those. I'd seen them in a, someone, excuse me, someone did a come shop for me them in there and I was like, oh, I need to find them. Alright, last bag. I grabbed, I found one of the little flower pot huggers, a little teddy bear. I thought that would be so cute. So I grabbed that. I did get one of the little filter albums. This is the only one I got. I thought it was really cute and I might just, I'm thinking I may fill it with pictures from my mom and send it to her. So, let's see. I grabbed two of these. I finally found them. They are small, and that's one of the things. Sometimes it's hard when you see them, like, especially when they come shop with me, um, and you're just kind of looking at stuff on the shelf. Sometimes it's hard to tell, and things look a lot bigger than they are. So they are small, but they are really, really cute. So I grabbed this one. I love you to the moon and back, and then the be the same person in the dark that you are in the light. I love the designs, and I love, they actually have a texture to them. Like a roughness, almost like it feels like wood. And I really, really like that. So I grabbed those two. And let's see if I can get... I grabbed two of the Mother's Day mugs. I saw them. I thought they were really cute. And for a dollar, I had to have them. So my husband will be super excited because I have way too many copy mugs already. But I get... Alright, so I grabbed this one that says Mom is just wow upside down. I just loved it. I thought it was really cute. So I got that one. Uh, and see, it is about impossible to find one that doesn't have some sort of imperfection on it. Alright, and then of course the same one everyone else has been hauling. I grabbed this one that has the watercolor style flowers. Really, really cute. Alright, so the last two items are what I found. Um, for my daughter's birthday, and I just thought they were really cute, and they would go with the little, um, like, 
tablecloth and that whole set that we got. I found this son with the sunglasses. I just thought he was really stinking cute. So I got that. And then I found the pineapple. So I was really, really excited to find that. That was one I definitely wanted to find. It was on my list. So really cute, really happy with it. But all right, that is it. Thanks so much for watching. And I will have one more Dollar Tree haul for you soon. Bye.